fought for that. And he adjusted and made it all the necessary changes. I believe it ended up 2-1, right? It did end up 2-1, yes. All right, all right, so we're gonna get Hotline uh, of Connecticut fame. Yeah. Uh, one, one of five, oh, this is actually interesting. So Stevie G, uh, Stevie G is the Fox, correct? It has I, to be. I believe so, yep. Stevie G playing the Fox, and then we have. Yeah, it has to be, okay, that's right. Because I was gonna say, uh, Hotline, Hotline is from Connecticut, plays with Fire Blaster, Blaster all the time. Stevie G, though, this should be an interesting match. It should be pretty close. Yeah. The Fox versus uh, Yoshi match is very interesting, and I, I like to watch it. It's very fun. Definitely. Um, uh, yeah, it's a really weird matchup because Fox has a lot of weird tools that give him an advantage in be able, being able to break armor and such. That is really good against Yoshi. Yeah. On the flip side, Yoshi against any character that's medium, heavy, or a fast faller has a great time getting combos to death. So definitely a matchup that can swing heavily in both directions Absolutely. at any moment. And Fo as a Fox main, you kind of want to use that down air because it's a multi-hit move. So if Yoshi's going to be throwing out these double jump cancel aerials, it's going to just eat right through those. Right. So you'll see a lot of down airs from uh, from Stevie G over here. And you'll probably see a lot of parries because once he actually gets the down air, usually the, the follow-up is either a down tilt or an up tilt. Just keep the combo going. Right. But uh, as a Yoshi main, you can easily, uh, if you know the timing, you can easily parry that. So you'll see probably a few parries from Hotline. All right, he's off stage, gets that throw. It's probably not gonna do it, but if he just grabs ledge, it will. Yeah, nice. Oh, oh but he gets off at last. So he did it too early, so then he lost the invincibility that he gets from grabbing the ledge. He grabbed ledge just a little too early. Oh, oh my goodness! Is that gonna kill? Oh That's my gonna gosh! Kill? Are you for real? I've, I've never, never seen, seen that seen before. That. I've never seen, first off, I've never seen an egg kill from opposite side of the map like that. Second off, I've never seen a reflect. Oh, duh, because reflect uh, makes it projectiles 1.5 times. Oh my gosh. And he was set such a high percent in the, in the first place. I mean, it, it makes sense, but like, I still don't believe it. I There are no projectiles in this game that are typically, oh, does he have a jump? I don't know if he has a jump. I think he does. Ah, uh, yeah, he does, okay. Those up tilts, they're, they're very good at shield pressure. No like, jump, all you have no to jump. Oh, That's it. That smart, good, good catch. Yeah, CBG, I, I, I try and catch it. It can be hard on commentary sometimes, but uh, yeah, so CBG, anytime he gets Yoshi with no jump. Nice parry, but he goes for a second grab, smart. Oh. Is that no jump That's again? it, that's no jump. Yeah, wow. he waited until the, the double jump armor had worn off. The jump had been going on for so long that he could just catch him at the end of it. That was smart. That was very, very heads up play from uh, Stevie G, right? Yeah. Stevie G, a Pennsylvania player? Yeah. I don't know if these two have played before. Um, I have no idea. Yeah, I'm not hotline, very good with uh, matchup knowledge. I, I think Hotline as as also too. plays a bit of Pika. So I'm waiting to see. I, I could definitely it looks like he's switching. thinking about it. Okay. Maybe, he was, maybe he was just considering what he wants to do. But uh, he's just going to stick with his main, uh, stick with, what he's, with what he's most comfortable with, I suppose. What? What is Stevie G's, I'll talk about it. <laughs> what is Stevie G's flag right now? <laughs> Interesting. Uh, it's the Nigerian flag. I think it might be the Nigerian flag. We, we're being told it's the Nigerian flag. I'm not sure why. Oh, he did it again, but it exploded before it hit the... Uh, before it hit... <laughs> All right. Yeah, okay, so apparently CVG is uh, he, definitely not a scam. Definitely a Nigerian <laughs> prince. Definitely needs your money in order to access his inheritance. Jeez, Louise. All right. Okay. So nice nair. Hotline. Gets stage. Trying to get the stock. Yeah. So Fox. Ooh, just barely misses that egg, but it gets that back air. Not gonna be enough to bring him off stage. Definitely. This is a matchup. Fox's recovery against a lot of characters is not the best, uh, and there's a lot of reason why he has trouble, especially against characters like Pikachu. Absolutely. But against Yoshi, he actually has a lot of tools for being able to get back to the stage. So it can be really challenging for Yoshi's to sort of finish off the stocks here. So we'll see how Hotline adjusts and is able to finish these off. 
And, ooh, wow, the up airs? Are we gonna get up airs? Oh, oh, nice. Interesting choice there. I'm not sure if that's exactly what he wanted. I thought he could continue the combo. Wow. See, Fox's recovery, it's, it's its a little bit shaky when you first start it out because you're staying in the same spot for a couple seconds. But once you actually get out of that up beat, your ability to fade in and out becomes so good. Fox, the best way to think about it is Fox's recovery, if he can get high, is very good. One of the better recoveries in the game. If Fox is even or below the stage, one of the worst recoveries in the game. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, just a little tap, takes care of it. Yeah, good good finish there. Wow. Wow. Just, uh, that was five down since in a row. That was... Uh, you know, sometimes if you just throw paper 32 times straight, you'll win some. Yeah, I bet. <laughs> I've been told. I mean, he didn't get punished, and he, I think he hit two of them. So okay. what we were saying before about the downers being a multi-hit move Ooh. and doing very well against Yoshi because of those double jump cancel aerials, up air is also a multi-hit move. So you can get away with doing a lot of up airs as long as you hit with both hits. Wow. And that's a good down smash. That'll take care of the stock. Down smash is very good against Yoshi. Sen at sends that. at a zero degree angle. Absolutely. So it sends him straight out. And Yoshi, if he can recover any type of high, is also great because his double jump armor allows him to go through so much. But if he's just too far from the stage, Yoshi doesn't have enough B. Man, it's just to get back to the ledge. I was surprised about oh, that. Oh, so the other thing you've seen CMG use a lot is up air, especially the first hit of up air yeah. that has set knockback. That's really great. If you can get no jump, no double jump off of Yoshi. Wow, the reverse ledge DI gets back to stage. You can combo to death there. But yeah, crazy, crazy finish there from CBG after Hotline had, or, sorry, from Hotline after CBG had the awesome recovery. That Tries shoot. the laser. I feel like if he had actually hit that laser up smash, he would have killed. It would have been an Because he didn't get that laser, it didn't. And that might be the game. CBG does have a full game to work with here, so if he loses this game, he's not out of it yet. But games matter in round robins. It's Dropping games is a little bit scary. CBG just trying to laser him out, forcing yeah, Hotline to come to him. I haven't seen a lot of lasers from, from no jump. this entire oh. set. Oh, gets back to ledge. Oh, oh, the laser up smash. The laser up smash. CBG looking very crispy in that match.